Hi everyone, I'm really happy to say we've got a new sponsor, KS International. They're suppliers of parts, lights, and all things to do with 4x4 trucks. You might ask me, what's in the box? Well, we've got a nice set of Osram spotlights. The Osram MX180CB are a 6000 Kelvin color temperature, similar to daylight, emitting 3000 lumens with high optical efficiency and a homogeneous light distribution. They're rated with an IP69K, meaning they're good for extreme environments of water, dust, impacts and permanent vibration. Housed in an aluminium case with a polycarbonate lenses covering 12 high performance long life LEDs. Available from the KS International website where you can find further product details which will be linked in the description. I have been thinking do I fit them on the Jeep or do I fit them on the Discovery? And we've decided today we're going to fit them on the Jeep, we're going to mount them on the bumper. Really nice set of lights they've sent us. Let's have a look at it taken out of the box. There's a fair weight to these as well. They're not, uh, not lightweight by any means. Nice to aluminium design. Osram on the front. These covers come off. Oh, and look, we've got some of that nice piece of blue plastic on there to be able to peel off. I think we need to get a shot of that, Harvey, as we peel that off. Oh, yeah, my favourite thing. And these uh, particular set, they have the inner, which is the daylight running light, and then the, around the outside is the spotlight. That uh, DLR should actually go nicely, I think, as well, with the DLR, which is over the, uh, over the wheel arches. I think we're going to probably mount them just around about here somewhere. I've got a couple of brackets I've been working on and then we should be able to wire those up into the auxiliary switches which already come uh, fitted in the uh, Rubicon. So, let's get on with it. Let there be light. Well, the light's just dimming down here, but the lights have come on. I really like the way that we've got the, uh, the side lights on the, uh, on the arches, which pretty much line up exactly with this nice Osram daylight running light in the middle of it as well. They seem pretty sturdy as well with those brackets we've put on there. And it really, I think, helps as well having the, the rather ugly uh, European bumper on the front. That helps to actually break it up a bit and make it a little bit smaller in there. So thank you very much. KS International, really appreciate you putting those uh, forward for us to test out. I'm now going to put the lights on full so we can see how that compares. As I said, I've got them wired up into the auxiliary switches. And you can simply switch them on here. And let's also put the, the main beam lights on as well so you can get the full impression. Oh wow right now. I'm guessing that's probably going to be blinding the camera as well. Really happy with those and they feel really good quality I must say. They're um, very heavy, very solid. Let's just try it with the fog lights on as well. One final piece. Got the full lights everywhere now. Thanks very much KS International. Really appreciate those. I think they fit really well. Really make it look uh, the business there. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and if you're not already a member, click that membership button and then we'll be able to ship you out one of our off-road rated JT stickers.